A partial solar eclipse will dim much of the western U.S. Saturday morning, including here in the valley. 8 News Now weather reporter Mary Jane Belliaza explain what's going to happen and how to safely see it. The countdown is on to the annular solar eclipse as the path for the eclipse will slide through several states, including Nevada. Uh, Jim Fahey kind of from the a... Astronomical Society of Nevada says some people mispronounce it as an annual eclipse, but it doesn't happen every year. Annular <laughs> refers to uh, the Greek as a circle. This is when the moon is far away from the uh, Earth in its orbit, and it doesn't cover the sun completely. And... Uh, if you're in the right spot, you can get a ring of fire of the sun around the moon. Since the moon is a bit farther away from Earth, it won't fully cover the sun like a total solar eclipse. Fahey says many people have been flocking to scenic spots for maximum view, like Ely, which is in White Pine County in central Nevada. The Ring of Fire Festival is expected to have a huge turnout. Interstate 80 from Winnemucca to Carlin, Nevada, where you can see this ring of fire fairly easily. It's important to protect your eyes during this event as eclipse blindness can happen when your eyes are exposed to the sun, damaging your retinas. So if you have an extra dose of UV light to which that part of your retina is exposed, um, your risks of central vision loss are much higher. Optometrist Dr. Jackie Bowen is the vice president of the American Optometric Association. She says eye damage may not feel as immediate. Even if you think it's not gonna be a problem, don't take the risk. That's why wearing eclipse glasses is crucial as it blocks all ultraviolet rays and almost all visible light. The annular solar eclipse is set to partially start in Nevada after 8 a.m. Mary Jane Belleza, 8 News Now. The eclipse will also be easy to see in Oregon, Utah, Arizona, and New Mexico. For more on viewing times and where you can get your solar eclipse sunglasses, you can head to our website, 8newsnow.com.